Hello and welcome back to my channel guys. Here is another get ready with me video. I'm gonna start off with tying up all of that hair just so I can get it out of my face. Now I'm gonna be just brushing my teeth like a normal human being would in the morning. And also washing my face and flossing as well. Now moving on to my face routine, I'm going to start off with putting on my eye cream. I am using the e.l.f. illuminating eye cream and I'm just going to pat it, well more like dot it, around my eyeballs and also the areas that have wrinkles that I want to apply towards just to get rid of or just deminimize, I guess. And now I am moving on to my Vaseline lip balm for my lips just so that they stay hydrated and look red and plump. And now we're going in with the Pond's Moisturizer. I'm going to just put it on my nose area since that area tends to be the most dry area for my face. And now lastly, I'm putting on some sunscreen with my Aveeno Moisturizer in SPF 15. Just patting it all over my face. Now taking my hair down, I am just going to spray some dry shampoo in it since it's looking a little oily and just kind of flat. So I'm using the usual Betsy's or Batsy's, I should say, dry shampoo as usual. After spraying dry shampoo, I'm just going to brush out my hair with a wet brush. Now moving into the makeup routine, I'm going to first start off applying my usual foundation. Of course, there wasn't much left, so I'm using it to just dot it all over my face instead. After applying foundation, I'm going to use this yellow concealer under my eyes from the Ulta kit. I'm just going to gently swipe it underneath both my eyes. Now grabbing a foundation brush, I'm just going to blend out the concealer and the foundation. Afterwards, I'm going to start off with putting primer on top of my eyelids from the Ulta kit. And now going in with the Urban Decay, I am grabbing Nude and just putting it as my base on my eyelids. Now I'm going to take this shimmery rosy pink and I'm just going to apply it on top of the nude and kind of just blend it in together. Moving on, I'm going to be taking this sunset red and I'm going to put it in the middle of my eyelids and just blend that out. I'm going to be blending it to the inner corners as well. Now going in with the Naked Palette, I am taking Extra Bitter and I'm just going to put that on top of that Sunset Red and blend it out even more. Going back to the Ulta kit, I'm going to use this baby pink color to blend out both of the two colors on top of my eyelids. And then I'm going to take this burnt orange brown color and just pop it on the edges of my eyes. Going back to the Naked palette, I'm going to take Instinct and I'm just going to pop that on more towards the end of my eyelids and just really make that sunset look come to life. And don't be afraid to use your fingers to really blend out or take out those colors. Now I'm going to be grabbing an angle brush and I'm basically using the same color and I'm just popping it underneath my eyelids just to blend everything out. Going back to that rosy shimmery pink color, we're just going to pop it near the front of the eyelids. And now I'm going to take this glittery champagne pink color and literally use that to pop my inner corner eyelids. And now taking my Dolly Wing Crayon Black Eyeliner, I'm using it to tight line pretty much my eyes. I feel like with Asian eyes you have to tight line or else the look just doesn't look complete. Now moving on, I'm going to be grabbing my black Dolly Wink liquid eyeliner and I'm just going to complete this look by giving myself some cat eye wing look. 
And of course, I'm going to be curling my upper eyelashes and I will be showing you guys that I'm going to be curling the bottom eyelashes as well just so that it makes my eyelashes look a lot more fuller. And now we have finally reached the last part of my eyes, which is completing it with black mascara. And of course, I'm using the Maybelline Great Lash Mascara, and it is in complete black. And of course, we can't forget bronzer. I'm using this Shimmery Sun Kiss color in brown. I have been loving bronzer these days because it just really makes my cheekbones look so good. We cannot forget the highlighter. I'm using this pinky champagne pink to give it one last pop on my face. Moving on to the lips, I am using a pink nude lip liner to just line out my lips. This really helps the lipstick stay put together. For my lips, I am using Cruel Ruby by Maybelline. I freaking love this color because it just completes the summer look. And I'm going to finish off the lips with some lip gloss just so that gives it a more shimmery and shiny look. And here is the completed makeup look. Time to change out of these PJs and into the summer look I go. For my top, I'm wearing a yellow tube top from American Eagle. As for the bottoms, I'm wearing high-waisted denim black shorts from Charlotte Russe and the current denim button that I'm putting on is from Forever 21. As for my shoes, I'm slipping into my Target black sandals as usual. These are my summer faves. And that is a wrap to this video. As always, please give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Leave any comments down below if you have any questions for me. And subscribe for more of just me in general. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, I truly, truly appreciate it. I hope you all have a wonderful, lovely day. Bye.